Honestly, I have to say St. Lucia is one of the nicest places I've been to. And the place is freaking beautiful. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. How many girls them turn up on a As soon as I step foot on a plane, I feel the depression just leave my body. <laughs> so how do we how do we fix that? It means I have to keep going and see new places. Just left the airport and pulled up to Blackbird. This is literally down the street from the airport. The airport is literally right over there. Y'all, why did I just lose one of my rings? Hello. <laughs> Like it's really spicy? Like the jerk is jerking. <laughs> Not the jerk is jerking. <laughs> she needs got the jerk bird. I got the jerk bird. Thank you. Good. Jasmine, what'd you get? I got calamari and plantain. Mm. Mm. Look at how crispy. Yeah. Yeah. That looks good. <laughs> like I will wait until I have the onions too. It's called put a baby in her. Let's see what it happens. It was spicy. Spice. Was I can smell it. There's a lot of spices in here. It's definitely spicy. <laughs> Not bad. No, listen. I've been here for an hour. I'm lit. There's no reason we've been here for maybe an hour and a half and I'm this drunk. Off of two drinks. They made that extra strong. I'm telling you. I did not even drink that much. I had a drink. I'll see you guys at side trip, okay? All right, thank you. I had a drink and a shot. Why am I lit? Oh my god! So. It's a, a lot, lot of wholesale plays for a second. <laughs> no, this one's like, where are we going? Yo, everything is here. Yo, Milo. Ooh, Milo. Milo. Yes. Yo, I it's grew Caribbean, up on this. You know this. This is all I drank as a kid. Yep. That's it. This yeah. and Horlicks. And Ovaltine. Arlix. 
Ovaltine, you never had Ovaltine? Yes, Ovaltine, Ovaltine cookies or no, Ovaltine? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, that's because I have So I know that's going to give you the munchies, okay? So maybe and I haven't had Ovaltine in a minute. Those are sauces. Maybe the, you want to take a sauce home? Sure. They probably... <laughs> You ain't lying though, no, maybe It's I the do. fact that there's one left. You might have to grab that, sis. Hey, why is it no? Because why is there only. Uh, I'm like, why is there one left? It's a big dog. What kind of is it? Browning. Yep. <laughs> oh, I know this is like that. Um, oh, they do that make the green. Like they, I need to, like, I've never. I do myself. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Yeah. And just store it for a little yeah. bit. You Did you used to go to Nicey's as a kid? And get like the little, you know, Nicey's, right? Yeah, you don't know Nicey's? Like, did you want to dance for it? Like, yeah. My my family would go there to get the seasonings and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I have no idea what Nicey's is. What the fuck? No. <laughs> Not they have apothic. You're not talking about apothic. <laughs> no, they have apothic rose. Oh, yeah. I never tried oh, that one though. Oh, we should try that. Right? Why is there one left? So, huh. 2017. I haven't had this one before, but uh, we're gonna try it. That's a rose. Yeah. It's so dark. I know Shanice is gonna hey, grab hot sauce. Hot sauce. What are you talking about? Absolutely insane. 
mean? This is so surreal. <laughs> this is insane. We in St. Lucia with it. Do you see this view? I haven't seen a view like this in a minute. God is good for real, cause all the time. All the time. We got to have an amazing trip. I brought my Bible too. I'm coming here in the morning, read my Bible. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Period. Well, this is actually insane. <laughs> It's hot. I'm about to go in the pool. And I actually have a video I need to send in. So I'm going to do that real quick. And just get a little cozy. We have the chef coming at 5. 5.30. Oh my god, my shower is cute. It's cute. I just got my braids done and they're still so like a little tight. Hey, this is amazing. God is good. I'm all changed. I'm gonna just get everybody in last, so let's get it. Let's get it going. Being a working girl, y'all. Dana was not existent for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I was. I fell asleep in the hammock. She did. <laughs> Laptop <laughs> in lap. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you want to do? I wish you got like, like a card game, game or something. Risha Roulette. You I mean, have it? No, I don't. I should have got it. I've been wanting to play it. Risha? They said Diddy was the one right in the car. <laughs> they said Diddy was right in Risha Roulette. What y'all want to hear? Song request. You wanna? Some gut. Some money man. <laughs> you like money man? I love money man. You hood ass bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I've been introduce you guys to the chef. She's here. Hello, hello. hello. How are you? Good, how are you today? I'm good. Yeah. Let the girls know what you're cooking up today. Oh, right now I'm making the tuna tartar. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be part of the potato pavi, which is... Ooh. Yes. We're also gonna be pairing it with some curried hummus and some fresh oops. So. That's what I'm working on right now. Yes, yeah, I'm a lot more coming. Yes, I'm excited. excited. Yeah. Well, it's smelling good in here. Thank you. It's smelling so so good in here. And we're also having cherry martinis, right? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Your mom. Oh man, I've never had one before. That sounds so good. Yeah. yeah that sounds sure. good. I love yeah, me a martini. I'm gonna get lit off of them. Yeah. 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 Vodka and gin. Yes. <laughs> Chef K. Chef K. Period. <laughs> Are y'all tired? Yeah, I mean, I can sleep, but... <laughs> I can always sleep. No, I can always sleep. I can lay horizontal. That's the best thing I'll fall asleep anywhere. No, I was going to say, we might have to go out. Yeah, I'm mean, Because they ain't got nothing to eat. They ain't got nothing to eat. They ain't got nothing to eat. Is there like a nightlife on a Thursday out here or not really? Uh, you should get a few places that are open on Thursday. Friday night, Saturday night, Sunday night. Yeah. 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 So we should save it for tomorrow and the day after? Yeah. Okay. Night in? Alright. We can do that. I'm cool with it.
Crispy, like the crispy rice, um, when you go to like sushi, spots, yeah, you know, sushi, mm -hmm. and it's like the crispy rice with the spicy tuna on top. This is like that, but Caribbean, this yeah. is like the literally, viral like potato. really, and this is curry, right? Yes, curry and hummus. Some oh, I know I'm gonna like the curry Thank hummus, you. and then the tamarind sauce. It was so good. Was All right, so let's amazing. try this, guys. Oh, that's good. Feel that? Mm -hmm. The little flavor? Bit of bit. A little bit of edible decoration. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can see. So enjoy, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Can I get so you guys a refill? Yes, yes please. Sure. Wow, look mm -hmm. at this food. Mm -mm -mm. This is the main course. It's not even heavy. Wow, how do you eat all the sauces with it? I, mean, it, it, I, I don't know. Everything tastes good have, together. You gotta grab everything. No, this is good. Oh, gosh, like this is really good. Mmm. Look good at so. It's so good. Would you prefer her and Fitz or her and uh, Jake? I like her and Fitz better. They're Jake so was awesome. nice, but Fitz, that chemistry was undeniable. Yeah. Her chemistry was. But so I could tell Jake crazy. really loved her. But Fitz, it, I don't know, it was just, it was different. Thank you. This is passion fruit. Yes. I love passion fruit. Literally so. paradise on a plate, guys. <laughs> Ooh. Thank you. So for our third and final course, we have a sour soup panna cotta with a passion fruit compote, some fresh fruit, watermelon, pineapple, and papaya. Mm -hmm. We also have some torched vanilla meringue and a spice cashew nut dust. So enjoy. Thank you so much. This Thank looks so you. good. If you guys know me, you know I love anything passion fruit flavored. So all this like raw, Real passion fruit is just, I'm excited for this. I can't get 
get over this view. Like, I cannot get over it. Good morning from St. Lucia. The host, Randy, actually ordered us some breakfast and dropped it off. I'm about to eat my breakfast. I let mine get a little bit cold because I was editing, but this is what I'm having. Some scrambled eggs, chicken sausage, a side of salad, and some toast. I wanted the roast bakes because um, that was the other option, but they're not making it today, so it wasn't available. So the restaurant did give us some jam for the toast, but I was like, wait, is there butter in here? And I found some butter. Butter and jam it just hits so differently than just jam like it's just i don't know it just hits together oh no so my bread got cold so i put it back in the toaster to reheat for like two seconds it's not even bread but why is it so tough oh my goodness <laughs> street party so i'm actually trying to figure out if i actually want to wear this i need some tape she needs to have some tape i need to get some from her but i'm just trying to figure out if i want to wear this i do want to wear this to dinner but i don't know if i want to wear this to the street party i want it to be dressed a lot more covered up and chill for the street party so i think i might bring a change of clothes if anything just to make my life easier but yeah i got ready and i mean i was trying to go for a super <laughs> light beat um i'm actually well, no, I'm wearing the Fenty Skin Tint, and I just added in a little bit of the Bobbi Brown Skin Weightless Foundation for a little more coverage. But yeah, I'm feeling this look, but I need to moisturize my skin, so I'm just gonna do that real quick, because I'm a little ashy right now. So I have to be ready for six, so I got ready real quick. I'm, the braids, listen, I know better than to do anything other than braids on vacation. <laughs> but I'm gonna moisturize with the Fenty um, Butter Drop. Okay, I'm gonna give myself a nice little glow on my collarbone. Do you see that moisture? Oh my goodness. This and the Youth to the People, the glow, it's like a glow moisturizer. That glow looks so good. Period. Glow We're gonna do our fragrance. I got these four new fragrances from Sempered, which is one of my favorite companies for fragrance. They are sponsoring today's video. So thank you, Sempered, for sponsoring today's video. If you don't know what Sempered is, Sempered is a subscription service that allows you to try out fragrances for just $17 a month. You get about a 30-day supply, to be honest. It honestly, it lasts me a lot longer than 30 days, so I love that. Especially if you're into luxury or niche 
fragrances. I for one have spent a lot of money on fragrances. And I wish I knew about Scentbird at a much earlier time because I would have saved a lot of money because they allow you to try out fragrances for a fraction of the cost. Pretty much all luxury or niche fragrances start at anywhere from $150 and can retail anywhere from three to $500 or more actually. Um, they can get really, really pricey. So I love that they allow you to try out some fragrances at a very affordable price. I do have a discount code for you guys, so make sure you click the link down below to subscribe to Sanford. And you can try out some fragrances for only $17 a month, which I mean, is super affordable compared to one full bottle. And if I'm being so honest, I have a lot of fragrances and most of them I have not finished. I got to pick out two fragrances and then they sent me two of their choice. So I picked out Tiziana Terenzi Draco and Mind Games Queening. They were both blind purchases, which I don't take lightly. Like blind purchasing or blind picking a fragrance is very risky business, but just based on the reviews, I knew I was really gonna like Draco and this one as well. So they smell really, really good. Draco is my personal favorite. Um, I have been really needing to get more of a spring summer appropriate fragrance because i feel like because i do have like my specific signature scent i find that over time a lot of my fragrances they don't all smell the same but i'm a very like warm warm on warm and spicy girl musky i love musk and i'm really lacking in the spring and summer fragrance department i probably only have about two that i would say is just a spring summer scent so i need some more so that's why i picked up the tiziana terenzi draco this smells so freaking good the draco has notes of bergamot peach jasmine cedar and vanilla i love vanilla jasmine all those scents this smells like a summer like a peachy summer day but not overly peachy like a peachy vanilla summer day to be honest i might just wear this <laughs> honestly maybe i might mix I haven't mixed them together yet, but I think I'm gonna mix. This smells so freaking good. And I love that they started carrying the fragrances in these cases, these protective cases. I don't travel with full-size bottles anymore. I've learned my lesson with that. So that's why Semper comes in handy because um, I just bring all my Semper fragrances. I actually have some other fragrances that I got from Semper that I brought as well because why bring a full-size bottle and risk breaking it? that i paid a lot for i also really love this one mind games queening this one is definitely more of a scent that i would typically wear this has clean cotton accord apple oris saffron and whipped vanilla bean you can definitely smell the whipped vanilla bean and the clean cotton accord the whipped vanilla bean it smells so good if i'm being honest i might just mix them tonight i haven't mixed them before mm, yeah they also sent me two of their choice. One of the other fragrances is Avant Quintessence. I actually really like this as well because this has a lot of notes that I really like. It's jasmine, vanilla, and musk, which those three are typically in all the fragrances that I really love. Once I hear any of those notes, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna like it. This also has an orange blossom. So this is a typical fragrance that I would pick out. Oh, this one is a lot different from what I would typically pick out. This one is from a brand called Dead Cool, and it's called Fragrance Number Three. Now this one is definitely um, not <laughs> for everyone. Very unique. I would honestly, personally, I would layer this with something. I don't think I would wear this on its own. This one has notes of juniper berries, pomelo, saffron, black violet, and blonde woods. And honestly, the only note that I'm familiar with in this fragrance is the saffron. Everything else I have never, to my knowledge, had in a fragrance before. Oh, but yeah, girls, especially if you're still trying to figure out what your signature scent is, I highly recommend a service like Semper because you get to try out different fragrances. And with my code, you actually can try them out for $8 a month. So, I mean... <laughs> We love savings, so um, yeah, thank you so much for sponsoring this video and just allowing the girls to smell good at an affordable price. We love that, so yeah, I'm basically ready. We actually have a driver, Randy, who is hosting us at this beautiful, stunning villa. It's going to be our driver, and where we're going for dinner is an hour and a half away, so we got to go, girl. I have a glass of... The rose that I'm gonna finish is 
I'm babysitting my drink right now. Maybe I could just tie it better. Yeah, but we're ready. I'm so excited, y'all. This is my first time in St. Lucia, and this place is freaking beautiful. Like, beautiful. Like, it's actually unreal. I just feel so blessed and grateful and happy to be here. I, see, I can't get over it, this glow. Okay, Venti. Okay, let me put on my shoes. The girls are waiting. Okay, cheers. Ooh, the face is peaked. Um, I, bitch, you took a whole fucking beat. She I know, I told her. I mean... Yeah, no, I, look, I tried not to. Y'all come look, look at Dana. Dana, come say hi to my mom. Not my mom, but my mom. Yes. Look at Dana. Period. Oh, y'all look so cute. Y'all look so cute. Now we're about to leave for the dinner. Thank you, Photograph Lab. Yeah, we'll have to go to dinner. The girls. Maybe we'll go on live in the car. We'll see. Look how cute they look. Oh. Hi. Hi. Jesus. So Hi. Cute. Cute. <laughs> <laughs> I was yes. trying to be calm. Yes, look. <laughs> Off to dinner. Everybody looks so cute. Look at Jasmine. Okay. Every, is everybody serving the bright colors? Yeah. How it's supposed to be. And then Shanice. Hey guys! Ooh, it's the glow for me. Hello. Oh, this lighting is so good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we all look so cute. Everybody looks so secret Black missing. Oh, put it in there. Put it in there. Not the little one. Yeah. <laughs> that was a long oh, car ride. So dirty. That felt like a two hour. Yeah. Was it two hours? It was an hour. It was like like, like, like yeah, hour and like 45 minute car ride to the restaurant. This is a whole strip. So many restaurants, bars, lounges. It's very busy. Mine too. It's really foggy. But yeah, as you can see, there's a lot going on on this strip. A lot of people outside. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I'm ready. Been ready. Oh yeah. Yeah, everything's fogging up. Unless like days up until her birthday, mm -hmm. and I was like, that was smart. Prosciutto, a mussel, some breadcrumbs. This is very fancy. Yes. Thank you. 
better than his mouth. <laughs> the short ribs and there's some shrimp on top some mashed potatoes this looks good it smells really good as well so yummy well, we got a bailey's white chocolate cheesecake mm. yummy thank you oh this is also a bailey's Thingy, right? Yeah. What is that? Oh my god, martini. Bailey's martini. Cheers. Cheers. We're headed to the street party. It's Friday night. Woo! <laughs> we just left dinner on our way to the street party and we're pulling up in a party bus. Yeah. Show me your foot. Show me your foot. Show me your foot. Show me your foot. See it here. Show me your foot. Show me your foot. <laughs> we love that. Street party, we made it. We made it. it really be all of us with our cameras. With our cameras. <laughs> Literally. Ooh, you hear the soca? Hey. Hey. Oh, the little Mon girl dog. <laughs>
Just left the street party and got to La Vie. La, la Vie. Oh! <laughs> she busting out a little crunch.
It is 6.20 and we just got back because the drive is about an hour and 40 and we left the club at like 3 a.m. I just did my skincare. Battery's dying so I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Do you have big peak and little peak respectively? You can scale both of them. You're looking at four hours for the bigger one, two hours up, two hours down, and about seven hours for the one in the back. Whoa. It's a little bit steeper. Wow. It takes a lot more time to get around. So pretty. I know. This is beautiful. What's the name of this lookout again? Majestic View. Uh, this view is just <sighs> insane. This is the majestic view. And as you can see, it is definitely majestic. There's a little goat over there. Mr. Curry. Yo, Curry. Yeah, he was just talking to me, I swear. No, literally, the camera is it not. It looks like nothing. I'm struggling. Like but in person, this looks insane. This is the petit bouton. This camera does not do this justice. This is so beautiful. Oh. <laughs> The town of Soufre, it means that because it's called the place of sulfur or sulfur in the air, we just came around the volcano not too far. This is a lovely town as you can see, the tourist capital of St. Lucia, wow. quite nice indeed. Wow. Yeah, over to the left you'll see one of the popular hotels, a place called Mountain in the distance there. Is that there in the bushes over there? Also to the left, the one that looks like a car park kind of. Oh. That's Jade Mountain. So it's one of the more prestigious hotels here in mm -hmm. Indonesia. Each room has an infinity pool that looks out onto the piton. It's an open concept, very lovely indeed. From here we'll do a viewpoint. Over there, so we can get it. Don't ever take it to my place, so we can carry on. I'm gonna wanna paint some of my people, I'm a infantry, but I'm not yesterday. My boss, a long time, I will walk up to this girl for me. I take it to my place, so we can carry on. I'm gonna wanna paint some of my people, I'm a infantry, but I'm not yesterday. My boss, a long time, I will walk up to this girl for me.
so we can carry on. Who wanna wanna be someone of your performer? It will change, but I know you said that my boss. A long time I will walk up now, this girl for me. Can take it to my place, so we can carry on. Who wanna wanna be someone of your performer? It will change, but I know you said that my boss. There we get a view from the other side of the valley just a few minutes ago. Able to see both pitons in view at this location. PT Piton is a little bit closer to us. Both Piton to the back. You can also see the volcano in this area. This hill that looks like it's shaved a little bit. You go down into the valley there. That's where the volcano or the sulfur spring. Right here in the middle? Yep. That's where the volcano is located. So that's the spot we're going to be doing next to get in the mud bath. The volcano here has been dormant for over 250 years or so and it would not erupt anytime soon since it has formed a caldera. It has sunk on itself and is considered inactive. Oh wow. You see it's not your typical dome ship volcano. Yeah. So you kind of got to go in the valley. It's also the only driving volcano. Okay. Yep. So you could drive right through it. Wow, really? Which is how we're going to be able to enjoy the salt <laughs> Tired. He's like, yeah, okay. <laughs> ah! I said, stay right there. And move. Please hurry up. What is it? What? Oh, <laughs> it's a little. I What is it? I just heard it was the so small. I just heard it. Like, don't move. <laughs> Once I hear that, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, you need to yell at I hate bugs. <laughs> Yes, please. Baron. Baron hot sauce. <laughs> 
We all ordered burger and fries, beef burger. Good. You keep getting all the animals. Hi. You got the chickens and the baby you chicks earlier. You are so night. cute. <laughs> no, it's the way he's just sitting and looking at us. He looks so polite. Like, he's so polite. No, literally. Like, oh my god, he's adorable. Yeah. Guys, we just made it to the sulfur springs. We're about to do the mud bath. Yeah. How hot is it really? Uh, generally, the water there stays between like 70 to 90 degrees for the most part. It's not too bad. Okay. Uh, but really nice. I didn't bring my light. And you said it's better to actually do it at night? Yeah, the best time is in the night. The facility itself stays open till about 10. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, with the sun not beating down on you. Best time is to be here. In okay, the that's good. Sure. Really good. Shanice is here saying it feels like fire on your skin. And I'm just like, uh, is it really that no, hot? No, it's, it's like a hot shower. Okay. I love hot showers. Dana, it's four feet tall, so she's gonna have one foot out of water, like a whole foot above her. Woo! Careful, there's like bare step. This is hot. How many? Not that bad. There's another step. Yeah. <laughs> They're gonna go down lower. <laughs> oh my god. Hold on. Little ladies, they're gonna go down lower. Oh, this is perfect. Okay, that's not bad. No, this is actually not bad at all. This, this feels bad. nice. I like this. You no, know it makes sense though. Also, that like, obviously the sun is getting hotter. hotter. So I'm glad we did this in the night. Yeah, so yeah, it's good that we did it in the night time. I do wish we had like a little bit of like, this is a bottle of rosé. <laughs> I know, right? I, I feel like I'm in a hot tub. I could stay in here. It feels great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Like your armpits? Yeah. Really? Under my armpits, he says. <laughs> <laughs> barbecue flavored rice cracker that we picked up at the grocery store. How's it taste? It doesn't taste bad. It didn't taste anything like what I thought it was going to taste like at all. Mm. Yeah, it was like way more airy than I thought it was going to be. Mm. 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 M
but the flavor of it isn't bad. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just eating anything. Very interesting. Taste. Tastes like a flame grilled cracker. Yeah. With some barbecue powder. Yeah. That's <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you described it perfectly. Mm, okay. Interesting. Shanice already got her shower ready. Yeah, she wasted no time. She wasted no time. You guys are coming back out here after the shower. Yeah, after the shower, do my skincare and come back downstairs. Okay. For wine. Oh, we're doing the same thing. I'm gonna go wash my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Number one property that baby. Even if it the fat. <laughs> <laughs> wine duty. Per. Wine duty. Cheers. This is literally right after the mud bath is really good. Mm, that's good. Yeah. As if we weren't drinking beer. It was great, guys. Yeah. A very eventful day. I think all that, like, walking and the sun and everything I made feel skinny. me very... <laughs> <laughs> I felt really skinny. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. We did a nice <laughs> detox on the body. My skin is so soft. I didn't even tell you guys. The mud, actually, mm -hmm. I can tell it has some nice skin benefits because after rinsing it off instantly, my skin felt really nice and soft. I kind of regret not putting some on my face and doing a face mask. Some people were actually doing that in the water, just <laughs> doing a whole skincare routine. But yeah, my skin's super soft right now. Love that. I love some exfoliation. Like These Caribbean Delight. Ooh. Are those good? I wonder which one did these taste. They're good. They're good. Cookie? Yeah. Chocolate chip chocolate chip cookie. cookie. Mm. Yeah. I don't know what we're gonna do for the rest of the night. We're probably just gonna chill. We don't have really much to do in the morning, so I know we're probably gonna wake up early. Start my day a little bit earlier. I need to do some tanning. Tomorrow's content day. Yeah, and it's gonna be content day, and then we have a boat ride in the evening at sunset. So we're really excited about that. Y'all wine for me, me have plans for your tight to me Make you do everything when you're tight to me Ride it like a bike for me Baby, me love you, believe me Push it up and make you feel it Bend over, receive me Me alone when she comes to speed it Freaky, y'all are my type Sick with them, we are like Me love you for the best of my life It's boat day. We just got here and we're ready to turn up. Hey y'all, ready? Yes. I'm so glad I brought some water because, baby, it's really hot. Oh, this bag here. Do we bring, do I bring this bag? Yeah. This bag? This bag? <laughs> oh my God. I can't help that I say bag like a Canadian. Okay. Thank you. Wow! Look at the boat! Okay! Look at Right? Look at the vibes! Look at the vibes! Oh my goodness! Yeah, we're ready! So cute! Oh. I'm nervous. This part was always scares me. Stepping on, right? Yeah. Wait till it gets closer Wait and then step up. Pass me a hand. <laughs> Dana, you're step so up. cute. Is it 
it's too tall for you? Yes. You gotta, okay. Do a tall, do a high step. You gotta do a high step. Yum, yum, yum. Oh my god, I'm starving. This is about to hit. Fish, we have like kingfish, um, chicken, potato salad, and toss salad. And for the toss salad, we have a vinaigrette and Thousand Island dress. Okay, thank you. Thank you, you well. so much. Lord, thank you for bringing us here today. Thank you for another day. We are so grateful to be here in your presence on this beautiful boat in this beautiful weather in St. Lucia. Thank you. Amongst God. these great thank people. You, Jesus. Amongst great people. Lord, thank you for this food. Bless the hand that prepared it. I hope this food nourishes our body. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Wow. Is it a breaker? <laughs> My knife broke. Wow, this is insane. This is the kind of food I wanted this entire time. Yep, that, I was gonna say that. Mm -hmm. Like, even more so than the secret. Hey, I don't care I want you. You should stop fighting. We got another one to tomorrow. When you pull me in my birthday. Be in the power. I'm not a 
Seashells. Seashells? Yeah. Oh, seashells, okay. Seashells on what beach? Hummingbird. Uh, hummingbird. Hummingbird. Mm. Mm. I just got a pina colada. Today's our last full day. Kind of sad about it, not gonna lie. We were making chocolate today. I'm excited. <laughs> we are so tired. The drive here, nobody said a peep. Not one word was said in the car. <laughs> and then we're going to the beach after. But we're making chocolate. I'm excited. Here's my little outfit of the day. This is what I'm wearing. This is look. Hold on, this view here behind us though is like I have no words. This is so beautiful. How is everyone feeling? Great. No, you you sound tired. <laughs> Come on, folks, you can do better than this. How is everyone feeling? Great. Woo, chocolate. <laughs> She's the only one ready to be. <laughs> folks, welcome to Project Chocolate's chocolate making experience. Woo! <laughs> Or should I say some more sweat in order to handcraft your very own chocolate bars which is why the water placed on the table it is not to add to your chocolate what do you do with the water drink it drink the water have you heard of the Mayans before yes today you will become the warriors <laughs> so folks do you think you are ready to make this bar of chocolate yes, yes. ingredients on the table you have 50 grams of roasted coconuts. Those needs have been fermented, dried, roasted, grinded, and ready to be used in today's activity. Same coconuts we incorporate in our savory dishes, beauty products, and we marinate it in Jersey milk to give us the ice cream of the gods. 22.5 grams refined sugar. We are using refined sugar so the particles will dissolve quicker. If we were to use regular sugar, we would be here the rest of the day. <laughs> and nine grams of cocoa butter. Mm. Cocoa butter comes from the unfermented cocoa beans. Those beans consist of 50% fat. 
place it in a hydraulic press, squeeze up the fat in order to process cocoa butter. This is the same cocoa butter you use for body lotion, cosmetics, and even stretch marks. The scientific name for cocoa butter is Theobroma oil. And the scientific name for cocoa is Theobroma cacao. When you combine the three ingredients, you will have 65% dark chocolate. Mm. Do we have milk chocolate lovers here? Let me see those hands. White chocolate lovers, let me see those hands. Oh, I just love all So, folks, <laughs> you are on the wrong top. <laughs> to disappoint you but we are not making milk and we are definitely not making white we are making the best the healthiest which is dark, dark chocolate, chocolate. Yeah. you have a hot black mortar which you shouldn't touch unless i tell you to let's grab the container with the leaves taste the leaves now i want you to taste the cocoa butter so now i have a very important question to ask where do you think the chocolate flavor is coming from? Is it the cocoa nibs or is it the cocoa butter? If you say nibs, raise your hand. Raise your hand if you say nibs for flavor. If you say butter, raise your hand. One, two, three, four, say butter. Those of you saying cocoa butter, you are not making chocolate today. <laughs> Those of you on the first part of the tour, what was said? No leaves, no chocolate. Grab all of your tissues as it is, fold it in half. This is a grip for your hot pots. Folks, at no point in time should you be adding any form of liquid to your chocolate. It doesn't blend. So go ahead, begin pounding aggressively. Release your inner mire. Challenge your partner in getting a pace. Lint. I'm sure you've heard of lint chocolate. 
So what do you think they added to this mixture to make it better? Sugar. Sugar. To counteract the bitterness that was in the chocolate. But folks, you will not dump all your sugar in at once. Folks, we do. I like my chocolate sweet. <laughs> I guess it just tastes as we go. <laughs> Taste test. Mmm. The cocoa butter and for flavor, vanilla. vanilla. That's it. So for those of you consuming white chocolate, you are consuming fat and sugar. Stick to the good stuff. The only thing white chocolate will give you is diabetes. That chocolate it raises the serotonin levels in the brain, keeps you happy, lowers the risk for heart disease, blood pressure, cholesterol. Whatever you have left inside your motor, it is yours to enjoy. You are on vacation, you count the memories, not the calories. You enjoy your hard work. Period. Okay. So? <laughs> One more tap. If you have any enemies, send them my way. Let me put them to work for you. <laughs> we also have trip advisor where you could log in and leave a review. Woo, that was fun. We have 30 minutes just to wait for everything to set. So we're gonna um, get our food as you guys heard. Ready to eat, right? <laughs> yeah, we're hungry. <laughs> Coco barbecue wings, white chocolate mash. Is that what I see in the mac and cheese? Where's the wings at? We don't have a wing? Coco. Oh. It's me like Coco. The chicken roti is so good. What's in the chicken roti? Is it just potato? And probably chocolate. <laughs> Full court cocoa burger, sweet potato wedge, garlic bread sticks. Those look good. These are the cocoa barbecue wings. We have market fish, plantain chips, which are right here. Cocoa mac and cheese. I'm curious to know what that tastes like. This is the chicken roti. That's the cocoa mac and cheese. I got the cocoa barbecue wings, cocoa mac and cheese, and then roasted veg. It's roasted pumpkin and tomato. And then she actually gave me all three dressings to try. So this is the papaya. The mango, mango, so good. mango dressing. This is the ginger and mint dressing. She actually recommended this one to eat with this. Oh, did she? Yeah, she did. So I'm just like, okay, we'll try it. And then I got a passion fruit juice. I love passion fruit juice. Like, it's my favorite. My mouth is watering crazy. Mm. I feel like I taste a hint of it, but. Would you give the wings? I'll give it like a seven out of 10. I'd need some spice. Okay, yeah. yeah. Cocoa Mac. Okay, it's definitely well seasoned. It has an unusual. Yeah. I'm not used to this cheese. Yeah, what I wonder what kind of cheese is. It's everyone reviewing your food. <laughs> we're, all we're on our well, we're on our Keithley Cold Club. You guys know he's in Toronto he's right now. Fresh, really? Yeah. yeah, he's like, I'm in Scarborough, Toronto, Ontario, Canada. <laughs> Is he only gonna go to Scarborough? I hope not. An 8.5 out of 10. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Oh, this mango dressing it just has yeah, a it's fire. Are gonna try the wings? Mm. That is good. Cheers! Um, the wings um, are like a 10 out of 10. They're so good. Yeah, it's like a sweet barbecue. Hot sauce would make it really good. You want to try the chicken roti? Pumpkin. Ginger mint. Mm. Mango. Mix 
see what she means. I like the mango, but the ginger mint actually tastes better. Is it the vegetable? Yeah. Why am I nervous? I hate getting on these things. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna step a little lower down, orange first, then on the white. But yeah, this view is amazing. Uh, we just made it to the beach and just loaded onto the boat because we're about to go to another beach. This is a little live. So let's hope I don't get nauseous. <laughs> this is just a whole vibe right now. Like my upper lip is sweating. Everything is sweating. and they love wearing mascara but since I didn't get any weird behavior from y'all I pretty much say you'll love and appreciate the box. Okay. <laughs> as, lo as I did say lots of ladies so they don't love the box but they love wearing the mascara not knowing in the mascara the main ingredient in there is called guano and guano comes from the bat job base. Guano? Yep. Mm. That's a mascara so that shit that on our Yeah I've heard that. It's the shit. It's the It's attached to this resort. After our meals, we got some dessert, and unfortunately, it kind of melted, but I'm just gonna eat it real quick right now, and then I'm gonna go in the water. St. Lucia is one of the nicest places I've been to.
when they make my tea, yeah. And me, I don't dance, dance, and your dad no more like me, yeah. So cute. Because I watch YouTube 24/7. Oh wow! <laughs> I, I hope to I hope to see myself on. on the oh road. yeah, you want to be in the video? Yeah, yeah. I'm a big fan. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna go get a drink. Mm. What's your name? Jasmine. Jasmine. Dana. And Dana. You guys are famous YouTubers. Yeah, yeah. Is it famous YouTuber? So we speak our native language, it's the Creole broken French. Uh -huh. Oh really? Yeah, if you want to learn, you can speak it at all. I speak a little bit French, but like European French. Yeah. I'm now a mes amis à la plage. I don't know, child. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. I said me and my friends were at the beach. La Plage. La Plage, oui. Okay. Oh, I speak broken. Say something. Say something. Huh? Say something. You say something freaky is going on YouTube. Say something freaky? It's going on YouTube. Well, then we should go down. Ah! He said it with his chest. Did you see not. that? Say it again. You understand. Cover your ear. You understand. Well, then we should go down. Uh, you understand? No. Nope. You know? I didn't hear anything he said. It's broken, broken French. Yeah. Oh, something for you. It's very nasty. Okay. I don't, right. don't want to know. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Somebody in the comments is going to tell us. Yeah. 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 Good for the comments. That's right. Yeah. Somebody's going to say something. Down below. What the heck did he just what say? Did he just say? <laughs> what did he just say? Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I have no idea. Oh, <laughs> you will be like, what the fuck? <laughs> But you guys want to learn some French, we can teach you. It's best to learn the... the I want a St. Lucian accent. Love how it sounds. I want a St. Lucian accent. <laughs> you should come live with us for two years. Then you find... Then That's kind of long. You're in Ireland, the two years comes very short. No. You party, you enjoy the beach. It's true. Yeah, and when you check in three months, mm -hmm. when you do three months walking, where you're really? from, it's yeah. like six months in St. Lucia. Where you're from? <laughs> I got a mango daiquiri and I'm excited to try because I've never had one before. So in St. Lucia, our national word is yeast salop. You know, if, you, if you're Canadian, French Canadian, you might know what a salop is. Well, the French call a salop bitch, but our national word is yeast salop. So they always see two, two guys fighting, mm -hmm. only where they have cricket on island. Mm -hmm. And the uh, cricket has more, not a six or four, you get the whole audience of yeast salop. Or whenever there's football, that's, that's what we call yeast salop. Okay. Very interesting. And if you don't like a guy, just tell him Tia Chula. Tia Chula. Yeah, that's, get, the get, the yeah. get the fuck away. Get the fuck away. I wish we knew that when we went to the party. <laughs> no, that would have been very... Um, I, saw, I okay. saw y'all running everywhere. All those guys trying to chase you. Who's going to the party? Say it again, Chula. I think so. Chula. Tia Chula. Chu? Chu. Chu. Yeah, Chula. It's very simple. Tia Chula. Keep on repeating it. Tia Chula. Tia Chula. Tia Chula. Tia Chula. Manas and respect. I like that. Manas and respect. It's coming out. Okay, let me go oh, on this side. Yeah, I'm like, where am I going? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. A little more <laughs> rum. More rum. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Woo! <laughs> I actually drink it. Good vibes. Good vibes all the time. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Thank you. Thank you. Very, very good. So we're back at the villa from 
the beach, picked up some food. Oh, you guys both names start with an A? Yeah. What's your name? Abigail and Anel. Abigail and Anel are about to give me and Jasmine <laughs> the best massages of our life. Anel is about to do mine. So we're just gonna... Oh, this is... Can you press the light face down? Oh, this is for Good morning. It is the last morning. I'm gonna do my makeup. It's like 6 a.m. right now, but I really just want to make the most of this morning. I've actually been wanting to shoot something like this um, in general, but I'm gonna prop my tripod over here. <laughs> I'm a little nervous, but I think I should be okay. You guys hear the rooster? He said, wake your ass up. But yeah, I wanna shoot it right here and just um, film me walking out, showing my outfit. And then that, and then showing the next one. Last day vibes. Last day, last morning. Getting on our flights. Tipsy. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh my god. Just the way, just the way. Jesus. That just scared the shit out of me. Are you posting today? Yes, sir. She's posting today. I am. The girls are posting. Your girl has been trying to just get some content before we leave this beautiful villa and beautiful island i'm sweating it's really hot i just was outside filming a lookbook a vacation lookbook and then when i finished thankfully i finished but my phone fell in the water and i know it's waterproof so it's fine but it's not letting me charge it and y'all my phone is dying and i have to go to the airport soon so i'm just kind of annoyed so i was actually getting ready to film I get dressed with me I just like to show some of the outfits individually and my phone's on eight percent and yeah i've been here trying to blow dry my the phone it still works fine let's see if it'll charge now i'm so i'm so annoyed i don't know what's going on because even before that why as i was getting ready to film my look look outside i put my tripod out there i put my phone on it came inside to put on my clothes and do the first look. The wind knocked over my tripod and took this off. So it's not broken, but for some reason, like I can't get it on. And one of the girls tried to fix it as well. And it's just, it wasn't working. So Jasmine gave me her tripod. Thank God. 
<laughs> just as I was about to start, that happened. Just as I finished, this happened. Ciao. The devil is working overtime, but he will not win. Okay, period. Disconnect to allow the connector to dry. Char charging now may damage your phone. Yeah, we don't want that, so. Ciao. I don't know. So we were telling Randy a few days ago that we wanted to try St. Lucia's national dish. Is that what he, oh, he actually did bring. This is green fig. Yeah. So he said their national dish is green fig and salt fish, which is basically like banana. You know, I'm Jamaican, so our national dish is ackee and salt fish. Um, so I love salt fish, so I was like, I need to try this. So we got some green fig. Mmm. And then you have some salt fish. Yum, yum, yum. Cucumber is a very popular vegetable here. I, I even saw on some of the menus, a lot of times the sides would be cucumber salad or cucumber. So there's some cucumber. I've never seen cucumber cut like this. <laughs> What's this? I'm going to assume some dressing or something. Some sauce or dressing. Oh, that smells so good. It smells like olive oil, salt, pepper, green onion, olive oil, and seasoning dressing and then i'm assuming this is more oil it smells like coconut oil um my phone is outside right now they said to leave it outside for at least 30 minutes or an hour i don't have an hour because we're leaving soon i'm hoping i can like get my phone to charge a little bit before we leave or at least i could charge it on my macbook in the car or at the airport i don't think i'm gonna get to film my other stuff i wanted to film my outfits individually I'm so mad, but at least I got to do the lookbook and I was just looking at the footage. It turned out so Nice, so I'm so excited to edit it. I was gonna edit it on my flight But we'll see if I can do that <laughs> Did it even out? Yeah, I feel like yeah, it you did, did even out oh, I was You definitely did her. your back is just darker like your backside. Oh, cuz I was tanning my booty And me and Dana are doing it. Shanice doesn't want and I just warmed up my and I just warmed up my food. Get on a mimosa. No, we got to drink the whole thing. We got to do another one. Huh? Come yeah, on, you want to get on your plane? You want to get on your plane a little lit? Yeah, you want to get on your plane a little lit? A little lit? Not a lot of lit. A little, a little, a little bit. I need this fucking tripod. Oh my god. You got the good of a guy now. So funny. Cheers. Oh. That's not that bad. I've been wanting this all day. All week. Do you think cucumbers? I love saltfish. No, I do. I love saltfish. Those saltfish fritters you had yesterday were good too. Were good, huh? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Have you had banana fritters? Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, you're like, you know, Jasmine knows this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> no, literally. Here's the breakfast. We got the cucumber salad. Green fig and saltfish. I'm excited for this. What do you give it out of 10? 10. 10. Oh, period. Wow. That's good. It's like the same thing as banana. Yeah. It's just minus the ackee. Yeah. And this little dressing is different, but this is what we should have been eating every morning. <laughs> and it's light too. Mm -hmm. it's Cheers! Yeah, I'm feeling it now. Damn. Um, Another one? <laughs> Can you pull down the black? <laughs> Shout out to Randy. <laughs> He's your guy, okay? Shout out to Clark. I'm 
where are we at? We're at a bar because we need one more shot before we get on this plane. Because we're crackheads. How strong do you want it? Not too strong. 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 Make it strong. Give my shoulder back. Ooh, 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 ooh. Been gone for too long. Sing it. Thank you. Spice her up. 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 Y'all, I don't know what I just signed up for. Because I'm already lit. Give me a shout out on your TikTok, okay? Okay. Thank you. She's so cute. I was like 16 and I went to a corner store. I went to a bodega. Hi, guys. Bye. Love you. Love you. Bye, Dina. Love you. Bye, Jess. Love you. Safe flight, guys, y'all. Let us know when you land. I will. Just now. Yeah, it'll.